An inequality in work division and basic rights between men and women used to be very marked in the communities of ethnic people in the remote areas of Lao Cai province. Now, thanks to the support of the provincial women's union and international organizations, the locals have had a chance to learn about gender equality and remarkably have changed their behavior. The husband does the washing while the wife takes care of the child. A few years ago, this scene was hardly seen in Hmong ethnic families in Lung Kho Nhin Common, Mương Kung District. In the past, Hmong ethnic women were supposed to do all the chores in the house, but recently, after joining training courses about gender equality and applying their understanding about women's role in family life, Hang Thị Cheng and her husband have seen a lot of changes in their lives. I've learned that I have the right to discuss with my husband about the work done in a family. In the past, I couldn't do that and I didn't know how to tell my husband my ideas. Now I'm much confident so I can share my thinking with my husband. For example, when I want to spend money on something for the family, I will ask my husband if he wants to buy it. If he says no, I will discuss it further with him and try to persuade him. Before we joined the training courses on gender equality, I used to keep all the money and decide what to buy or sell. Now my wife and I manage the spending in my family together. Having understood the concept of gender equality, Lu Văn Thường in Lung Khung Nhin Common is now well aware of the woman's role in the family. Now he often asks for his wife's opinion before doing important things for the family. His house has recently been repaired thanks to efforts by both Thường and his wife. We manage our money together and we discuss a situation before we act on it. When I decided to rebuild the house, I asked my wife for her ideas on the reconstruction. As you can see, many local ethnic women are gathering here to discuss the plans in anticipation for the Lunar New Year celebration and the International Women's Day. And this is a very regular event of the local women union to provide the members with chances to discuss and share the issues concerning their lives. The meeting includes members of the key groups who will communicate their knowledge of gender equality to the community. The local women's union has created about 12 key groups with more than 300 members in total, including men. According to the union, the local ethnic women have now been able to express their ideas regarding their families and social activities. For example, today they have agreed to celebrate Women's Day with a party arranged and catered by their husbands and sons. After joining the meeting and the training on gender equality, the local women's skills in managing group activities has improved. Their role in the family has also been upgraded, so the work division at home has been changed in a fair manner. This is a training class on gender equality for the leaders of the key groups held jointly by the Provincial Women's Union and Oxfam. And this is a painting illustrating the path toward gender equality drawn by the Chinese. By using less theory and more practical activities, training classes like this have helped more than 5,000 people in the mountainous area of Lao Cai province better understand gender equality. We try to organize different classes for women and men because they learn about the gender equality in different ways. Plus, we also create training courses that use the local language to communicate with participants who can't speak the national language well. According to the Provincial Women's Union, after two years of disseminating their knowledge of gender equality to the local ethnic communities, about 60% of the men in the mountainous areas have shown positive changes in their attitude and behavior toward gender equality. However, the remaining 40% are more resistant to making these changes. I think that the toughest challenge comes from the customs and thinking which have deeply penetrated the outlook of many people. 
I think we need to keep communicating knowledge about gender equality to people patiently and constantly to change the old ways of thinking. Starting in 2012, the project on raising people's awareness of gender equality has been implemented mainly in the two districts of Basat and Mung Khương in Lao Cai province. In addition to communicating methods, the project also offers pigs and farming skills to the local women, helping them to manage the family economy, thereby uplifting their role in the family and society. The project is scheduled to end in 2015, but with the initial success, the organizer expect it will be further expanded to other areas in Lao Cai province.